What is up, Pete? This is your boy, Jay. I am sitting in the Mark 8, and we finally have sound, guys. We have sound. I took my, uh, this old radio here. It was inside of the Crown Vic, and I swapped it out with the 10-inch. So I took that radio out and put this in here. Now, mind you guys, this car has eight speakers. It has four regular speakers and four tweeters. Now, I had to replace the two front tweeters because they stopped working. And I replaced them with these here. These little four-way scotias that I had. And I took those. These here was in the, uh, the Black Panther in the grill. I took them out of the grill from the Black Panther and put them into here. And I, you know, drilled some, uh, drilled some um, bolts in to hold them in place so they can sit flush like they actually belong and i ended up changing the, these jbl door speakers that was in here changed these out and these out so i changed all of the door speakers out and the tweets and as you and i can tell you these original tweeters back here they still work the original tweeters here they still work we do have sound in the car so i mean i can turn the car on and see if i can play something that is that doesn't get me a copyright strike I mean, I'll find, well, something. I'll play something, some video game music or something, just to show you that we have sound. And, yeah, by the way, I had to change this key tumbler, too, because the original one, it, it, it kept twisting. So, um, I replaced the key tumbler here. And, you know, this car has three keys instead of two. That's the one for the ignition, one for the door, and one for the trunk. So, that's weird, but okay. We're going to start the car. I'm going to start it. So, and see if we can pull up some music for sound or something. Four valve. Okay, that's weird. Radio usually doesn't turn on like this, but okay. I wonder what's going on here. Give me a second, guys. All right, guys, I'm back. Um, I had to get the radio to power itself on, and we do got the radio powered on. So now we're going to play some music. Um. I'll just play something. I'll play something. I'll play Sonic the Hedgehog or something. I don't it, Just to let you know we got sound. And I do not own the rights to the music. This music belongs to Sega. Yo. So it doesn't belong to me. This is Sega's music is not mine. So just to let you guys know. I'll start with. Uh, I'll just play something. Um, I'll play anything. So. you have it guys now i just have to um finish connecting everything in here now that you know that we have sound i gotta do the uh rcas for the amps um the camera the navigation um yeah i gotta put all the stuff in here the wires for the t uh run the tvs all this stuff i mean yeah i'm not done yet guys i am not done so I just got to, you know, finish up here. I had, the, like I said, the task of rewiring all of these door speakers and everything yesterday. Trust me, this took a, a, a long time to do, guys. So I had to wire all eight of Well, actually, the two the two speakers here, the tweets here, they actually connect with these here. So you can run those together. So, yeah, you can actually run those together. 
I mean, they were pretty much wired like that to the amplifier, but I just end up running them together to here. And like I said, these here is this. I cut this out of a uh, a 95 Crown Vic and wired all of the colors because these colors here are actually the same with the door colors. So I end up wiring them each and I um, just pretty much uh, take them off. I'm going to connect these, these and these together. And I'm going to tape them some more. You know, I'm going to finish taping these up here so I can make it look nice and neat and clean back here. And this here, we're going to put this out of the way because this is just in the way here. So, so we got room to put the double DN in here. So I just have to trim these little, little top piece up here. I had to trim that down in there. And we can slide the double DN straight in. It'll slide straight in. So, yeah. Um... I'm working on it, people. I am working on it, guys. And the reason why this is still on and the radio is still on because I haven't opened the door yet. Once I open the door, the radio and the what's the name will power itself off. See, like this. See? The radio and the what's the name powered itself off. But see, as long as I take the key out, it'll still be on. But as soon as I open the door, It'll power itself off. And these are on because I turned these on myself. But, yeah, guys, uh, this is the Mark 8 update here. We're getting it together, guys. We got sound now. I just got I got the RCAs ran together here for uh, when I get ready to put the amps in here. I run the amps. So, I got the RCAs for the amps. So, yeah, one for uh, the amp that I'm running to the grill speakers. And I got the one for the bass. So, we're going to... I normally run one RCA, but I'm going to run two. So, I'm running two back there. And then, the, the, what's the name back here has a slot for two. You can run um, front and rear. So, I can use this for either front or rear, which doesn't make a difference because I'm going to be running two amplifiers in here anyway. And this is for the remote turn on and the camera. I've already got everything ran so far. Like I said, we got this. We got the navigation we have the camera there's the navigation antenna right here um the wire for the camera to connect the camera right here just move all this stuff out of the way here but yeah that's it right there guys so we're getting it together so i'm just just trying to get everything in order so pretty much we can get this car you know where we want it, where we need to get it so yeah well guys this is all I have for this car right now. And this is your boy Jay. Signing off saying peace, love, power. Be safe. Be blessed. I'm out.